back with Synergy K Fit as we explore more out of those said controlled articulations. Controlled articulations are super important because when we're interacting our body and moving with purpose, i.e. running, there's a whole bunch of sequences of rotation, stability that needs to happen at those said rotations and areas that need to lock in and stay stable and other areas that need to be mobile and be spongy. We don't necessarily get that if our dynamics or our gait pattern and our mechanisms are off. And we can never explore those issues or those dysfunctions without breaking down those said movement patterns. So that's what she's learning to do for not only herself, but also her clients. If you're looking at this, this is a little bit more advanced. She is more of an advanced person when you're coming to stuff like this. Because in this one, she has to use a singular movement pattern through one hip while the other leg stays in kind of that locked position that you would see when you are committing to your next stride in your run. She works through these extreme positions of external and internal hip mobility ranges. She has to find those areas of stability and alignment in the other quadrant or other half of her body, which allows her to really explore that strength. And I guess time under tension method allows us to keep us stiff and stable when we're running especially when we turn it up and we got a sprint you don't want to be all over the place where you're doing a whole bunch of this okay a great exercise again this is a little bit more advanced this is after all the other stuff we did to really endure these areas for stability mobility alignment and power one leg controlled articular rotation. She's going to pull most of her weight into that said space or that holding structure, this pole here. 